Are we really ready for 5G? As much as IoT devices, content delivery networks, and consumer apps claim to be 5G ready, it's the networks that are scrambling to deliver. True 5G is dependent on edge computing, where data needs to be closer to customers anywhere in the world. Thus, there's an increasing groundswell by networks to bolster edge data centers. And the biggest area that needs bolstering is storage. SSDs are multiplying like rabbits at the edge, both because of their ability to scale quickly and provide predictable performance and quality of service. Content delivery networks and IoT applications are largely dependent on SSDs. In both cases, data is rapidly created and stored locally, which feeds into the local edge node and then ultimately goes out to the cloud. Often, data is even synchronized to another local data center. For CDNs, more data is distributed out to the edge and stored locally for rapid access. And for IoT, more is created locally and distributed upstream for later access. And the storage performance here needs to be incredibly fast because we're taking in huge volumes of streaming data from the IoT apps. Data is coming in, being computed, and just as quickly being read out. We want drives at the edge that can not only ingest at volume, but deliver with stability, reliability, and minimal latency for any real-time application processing. CDNs are under an equal amount of stress. Consumer TV and video on demand content, as well as live streaming apps, are putting a tremendous burden on the networks to deliver seamless, uninterrupted media. In big metro areas where demand will be high, CDNs need to be storing content closer to the population centers. While streaming a Netflix movie or live stream, we need to have content coming from a data center as close as possible to the users who request it. Simply put, if you want fast streams, we can't have the entire population of Los Angeles demanding data coming from Kansas or New York. SSDs are critical to this distributed model, as the applications are doing a lot of read-only processing. Even with live streamers, the audience is predominantly only watching with minimal interaction. That's more read than write. Regardless of video consumption or creation, CDNs and service providers need enterprise SSDs that deliver consistent performance. Latency is most noticeable when it shows up at the edge. If I'm used to it taking three seconds to have a movie start playing, and soon it takes 30 seconds, I get kind of frustrated. Latency can happen anywhere in the data transmission, but we can fight it by starting with how we access data in storage. We mainly address latency in the SSD through the firmware, but we've also got some hardware features like big DRAM caches that enable us to smooth out delivery. The bottom line is that maintaining QoS requires a combination of software and hardware design. Edge networking providers have to really pay attention to performance consistency. With more devices, more consumers, and more data flowing through the networks at any given time, edge service providers will want their SSDs and entire stack to scale performance consistently with an increased workload. Some analysts predict that the days of mega centers are gone. With 5G, data has to be spread out across the network instead of a single data center. This requires data centers around the world working in redundant fashion to provide the same content, applications, and data across the network. To achieve this, many edge networks will likely experience rapid storage bloat. Data demand will continue to grow at an exponential rate, meaning that data centers at the edge won't be able to keep up without increasing storage capacity. Tapping into the power of edge computing is exciting for networks, data center managers, and more importantly, consumer applications and services. But given the millions of people and devices creating, storing, accessing, and synchronizing data from one edge to another is incredibly complex. That's why it's increasingly important to start with the right SSDs as a foundation and work out to every edge to ensure consistency of performance across the entire network.